Finally able to, to kind of put one away, uh, you know, after having a couple of leads the first couple of games to today, even though they tied it, you guys kind of, you know, rally, get that, that big hit. Uh, Ernie Yakes, the guys you talked about, but how important was it to finally get one uh, and get that win out here? Well, it is important because the first one and you kind of forget, you know, that it's baseball and there's weird things going to happen. But nice to get the first one and, and uh, finish it off. And obviously Legamina came in and lights out and that's what we're hoping from them. And, and, uh, We've, we've done a lot of good things in the first two games other than close it out. So uh, today maybe rewarded a little bit for that. Ernie Yakes, the guy that gets the, the, the game winning hit for you, the go ahead run there. Uh, he's the guy that you talked about a little bit earlier in the season or earlier before the season that uh, you're know, expecting some big things out of. Just a good baseball player. I mean, he's a redshirt freshman, um, but he, he plays good defense. He runs the base as well. He's got above average speed. And he's got a good feel for the strike zone, and, he's, and he can repeat his swing. He's, he's going to be a really good player. He had two RBIs today. Jake Veith also has two RBIs, hitting the bomb. Uh, is he a guy that looks like he can unlock his uh, power potential a little bit this year? Yeah, he, I mean, he's shown it in, in everywhere except maybe the numbers last year, but that's a junior college player, and sometimes they, there's a little transition period. So, yeah, we're hopeful that he, he will do that. And he, he's just he, he's much more mature this year as far as being disciplined and, and not letting the failure get to him. And, we have high hopes for him for sure. What are you hoping to learn from your team still in the first couple weeks of the season? What's something you're still looking at? Yeah, the main thing is we feel like we can play really good defense and offensively we, we've got some, definitely got some pieces and we're a little more, um, we have a little more flexibility. We can run and do some things. What we really are looking to do is, is decide what, what are we going to do with the pitching staff. And I, I imagine everybody's going to do that, maybe not Oregon State, but um, <laughs> This first year, we really haven't had that true, proven number one starter back that won eight to ten games. But we've got guys that can do it, and, and but we lost a lot on the mound, so we're trying to figure out where where our pieces are going to fit, and and that's what this weekend's about.